Today we are going to demonstrate how easy it is to make a booking on the TrendCall website. So I'm here at TrendCallLimited.com and the booking process consists of three simple steps. First step is you create an account. Second step, you look for your rental space. And third step, you fill in your details. So let's get right to it. Let me show you how to create an account. Just look on the top right hand side of the page. I'm on a desktop here and you would see the make account button. Now, if you are on a mobile device like a phone, you may see this button in some other area of your screen. So just click it. And now I'm going to register for a new account. If I had an account before, I would just put in my username and password and go back in. This is especially good for recurrent users. Um, so let's go ahead and create an account. So if my username I wanted to create was Frank and my password, I'm going to put in my password. Now I'm going to put in my phone number. I'm going to put in my email address. Now I'm going to fill in my name. Okay, so I just filled in my name, my email address, my mobile number, my username and password. Make sure and remember your username and your password because you will need to get in back in site at some other time. If you forget it, you will have to do a password reset. You would just click on forgot password in order to get your password reset. Okay, so just click on the register button now. Okay, so the username already exists. So let me just make up another username. So probably I could put Frank 2023. How about that as him? And let me see. Okay, so it went through. And I would see this message, Regist registration complete. Please check your email and activate your account. So let me hop on over to my email. And here is the email, the activation link. Just click on it. It will activate your account. Then you will see this green banner, your account is activated please log in below so you, you will need to log in again um so it was frank 2023 and then my password and i'm logging in so now my account has been activated so step one is done notice i have no reservations if I did reservations previously and I booked spaces previously, I would see all my historical bookings right here. So that's step one, create the account. So now you could go ahead on the website and browse it and look for your rental spaces. So suppose I want to book a air condition classroom. I would go across here. Okay, so suppose I want to book an air conditioned classroom. I'm going into the rental area on the menu. I'm looking for air conditioned classroom. I'm clicking it and I'm looking to book my air conditioned classroom. I have my classes. So suppose I wanted it on 6th and I wanted it from 9 to 11 am and I would click book now 
All right, so step two was done. I selected my rental space and now is the third step, which is you just need to add your additional information. So um, it's a classroom, so I don't need any extra chairs and, and so forth because I've got that in the classroom already. Um, notice I'll see how much money I will have to pay right here. And now it's very important to add your additional information. So um, you should put your correct address. So if it's like Lampool 15 and it was in street and it was in a country here. And well, zip codes, you don't have any zip codes, you kept five zeros. Um, number of guests. So I'm going to have a class with about 20 students. So I'm going to put 20 here. I'm going to say I'm going to have a little in technology class for five students. So I just added my note. I don't have any coupon. So now I'm just clicking on checkout. And I would see my information here just to review it. Now notice anytime you make a booking, there are additional charges. For example, VAT, public liability insurance, and, and so forth. So you would see your new total here. Very transparent and just click on send request so when you send the request the booking is not finalized in fact the admin in trend call will have to approve your booking so once you click send request it goes across and then it's in their hands to approve the bookings now as soon as the booking is approved you will notice it in your account so once you click on your my account area so i'm in my account area right here so if i click on return to my account page i could return to it and remember if i click on the top right at any time and log in i will get to this same page and you would see your booking i would say that that it's pending all right if in case i was approved i would see that this booking is approved or i would see pending payment or something like that so if you see pending payment, you have to go in and make your payment or they would send you an online link where you could make your payment using a card. And then once you do that, they will see that you made your payment and they will set it to um, paid and your booking been um, completed and approved. Okay, so simple booking process once again. Um, as I said, just to recap, it's a simple booking process. Three steps. First step is you create the account. Second step is you look for your rental space. And the third step is you add in your details. And then it will be in the hands of the trend call admin to approve your booking. Okay, everyone, I hope this video was helpful. And remember, you could always contact us in the contact area in case you have any questions for us and we will get back to you or you could use the live chat feature okay bye for now